Look, Everton's victory in the appeal over the Premier League's legal costs was an immediate relief, but it could end up causing a headache for everyone in the league. The club managed to reduce the £4.9 million the Premier League wanted to, a more bearable £1.7 million. Nice, right? But, as the Liverpool Echo warns, this could have set a dangerous precedent for the next big challenge. The Manchester City case, and it's more than 100 allegation. Just imagine. City have one of the most expensive lawyers in the world, Lord Panic, and the cost of this legal battle is going to be monstrous. Regardless of who wins, the bill will be heavy for the Premier League. And here's the problem. Even if Everton escaped paying the full amount, the bill will come in another way. Since the 20 Premier League clubs share the governance costs, some of this money will end up coming out of everyone's pockets. That is, Everton too. So, the victory was a bit bittersweet. Although the Toffees have saved £3.2 million now, when the bill for the City deal comes in, everyone will feel the pinch. And with Goodison Park's finances in a tight spot, expected to struggle next month if no new investors are found, this short-term financial relief may not last as long as it seems. The hope is that by then, John Texter or another buyer will have taken control, and the club's financial future will be clearer. To make matters worse, this Manchester City saga doesn't look like it will end anytime soon. The case is expected to take a while to resolve, so until then, Everton need to focus on one crucial thing, staying in the Premier League. Their performances on the pitch need to improve, and fast. Current manager Sean Dyche is under pressure. There are already rumors that he could be sacked, and intermediaries are scouting potential replacements after a disappointing start to the season. Once again, the Toffees look set for another relegation battle. In other words, the victory in court was a small relief, but the biggest challenges still lie ahead. Now, all that's left is to hope that the team improves on the field and that the situation off the field is resolved soon.